This episode of Science Max is all about storing energy and releasing it. Yeah, let's try it out for real. Storing it in a giant spool racer. Plus a domino chain reaction, mouse trap chain reaction, popsicle stick chain reaction, and more. All on this episode of Science Max Experiments at Large. <laughs> okay, three, two, one, go. Ready? I'm on it. Anthony and I have built a large okay, spool three, racer. Oh, it's working. It's working. <laughs> <laughs> and it worked so well, the only option was to go bigger. What is this? this is an industrial cable spool, and this is the biggest size that they make. I think this could generate a huge amount of energy. Huge... Building our giant spool racer is the same process as the other builds. So the steps are exactly the same, but on a larger scale. And this time, we're going to use, obviously, the large spool, and we're going to use this 2x4 as our pencil windy thing. Coil some bungee cord, feed it through. Ready? Yep. Okay, here it comes. Ah, there we go. Got it? Haha, <laughs> yeah. Add a washer and a long 2x4 to act as our pencil. And now we stick the giant 2x4 inside the coil. Just about. Yeah, we got it. There okay, we cool. go. And we're ready to try it out. So it looks like we're ready to go. Yeah, exactly. Uh, do you want to do it in here or you want to do it outside? Oh, definitely outside. Okay, let's go. Yeah, okay, cool. Yep. Oh, it's heavy. Right. Are you ready? Ready! Okay, here we go! Oh. <laughs> it's working! It's working! Yeah! <laughs> sure enough, all the potential energy we stored in the bungee cords starts to unwind, which rolls the spool and pulls me along behind it. What's more, that big heavy spool has a lot of momentum. Yeah. So when it gets going fast, it just wants to keep moving. It wasn't long before I had to jump off. Uh oh 